years touring with Ozzy. So you've, 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 have you been uh, your friends with Ozzy? I yeah, we've, we've known the, the Sabbath lads for, for ages, you know. Since we, the 70s, really? Yeah, we, we, we run into each other all the time, you know. We've done done quite a bit of work with, with Ozzy and Sabbath over the years. Um, I mean, the, 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 one of the most extensive things we did was uh, 2004, uh, and we did the Ozfest yeah. in, in uh, you know, and that was ten weeks, something like that, you know, which is great. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So that uh, you know, and that was a that was a Sabbath run. It wasn't just Ozzy, you know. The Sabbath lads were there as well, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and uh, we have a lot of respect for for, for Ozzy and Sabbath, yeah. you know. We, we we both go back a long way, really. And Ozfest, does it have uh, do do bands interconnect? I mean, do do bands connect? Uh, is it like a f- for a long tour? Uh, is everything very rigid, or or as as big tour? are or do you get to uh, hang out a little bit with each other yeah, occasionally you get to hang out oh, you know um, but uh, you, you know like it like now for instance Ozzy isn't here at the moment mm-hmm. you know because he's not on till later mm-hmm. and unless you're doing something sitting around in a dressing room for hours yeah. you know it can, be, it can be a bit tedious yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, sometimes you stay at the same hotel. Sometimes you say, "Oh, you know, somebody's in a bar somewhere, so we're going to have a drink or mm-hmm. a restaurant or whatever." Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you sometimes get to mix with the folks, mm-hmm. you know, good, with the folks. Good. good. And uh, um, so, uh, did, did you ever imagine back? Th- uh, this might be a little trite. I tried not to ask, as you might have noticed. Uh, I try not to ask things that everyone else asks. But um, did, did you ever think back in the day when you were maybe hanging out and having drinks with the lads, uh, such as Sabbath, for instance, the Sabbath Boys? Uh, were uh, maybe 40 years on, you would be touring the world with them. It's kind of yeah, I know. It's, it, it, it is, and it's, it's, it's amazing when you think about it. <laughs> we, we just didn't think that, that we'd be going for well for 50 years, near enough, you know. Um, I mean, the concept of some people our age playing popular music just didn't exist back then. Yeah. Uh, I mean, in, in the late 60s and early 70s, even the old rock and rollers, and the, you know, even they weren't in just about in their 40s, you know. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Um, and even Frank Sinatra's and the old crooners before that, they were only in their 50s. Uh-huh. You know, so somebody 60, you know, jigging about on stage, it didn't exist. <laughs> uh-huh. um, so it's an unknown, totally unknown quantity. But yeah, I mean, we, we, we love it. We love what we do, you know, so, so that's why we've kept it going all these years. And uh, as soon as we stop enjoying it, we'll probably stop. There's no point in doing it, you know. But, um, but at the moment, we're all loving it, which is great. You know.